So have you got an interest in astronomy then? I do have a genuine interest in astronomy. I've got books on it, I've got several telescopes, never really got them working. You've got several telescopes? Many telescopes. How many have you got? At least three quite big ones. Three? OK, so this is our big budget-busting solar storm, and here's the sun, seething mass of plasma. And Marek, if you can take the Earth and head over in that direction, 93 million miles. Now, when we have these big solar storms, the sun will kick out a load of energy by way of electrically charged particles, and we see that as a coronal mass ejection. And here's our demonstration of a coronal mass ejection heading towards Earth at about a million miles per hour. It will pass through the planet Mercury, it will pass through the planet Venus. It actually take a couple of days to get here. And when it does work like that, You've got three of these, yes, sir. and with a bit of practice and a bit of knowledge, you're going to see some incredible sights. But I knew there'd be a but. You need to kind of go back to the beginning and start off on the easier stuff first. With the binoculars? And possibly even the eye. I've done that. Let's get outside. So we just use Come a naked on. eye. Outside. What's the point of having you if you're just going to, I could do that on my own? The stars and planets above us are dynamic entities, constantly moving and changing, which means every time night falls, there's something new to see. So I've come to the dramatic coastline at Southern Down in South Wales to see what mysteries tonight's sky might reveal. Once you've taken some photographs of constellations, the next thing you might want to try is taking pictures of planets through a telescope. Now some surprisingly impressive results can be had by using a simple compact camera, placing it against the eyepiece of a telescope, take a picture, you can get some amazing images. I don't think I've ever seen this many stars, even on, on camping trips and so on. Oh, Mitchell! I saw that one! Yes, happy days. We can go home now.